Hello, and welcome to another edition of DGN High School Game Day. With me today are my colleagues Liam and Mike. Unfortunately, Ben cannot be with us today. No one's seen him since the Oak Park game. I think he's still stuck in the 70s. Yes, sir, Matt, it's a pleasure to be here. Today we have a special edition of High School Game Day. Without further ado, let's introduce our special guest, Mr. John Gruden from Monday Night Football. How you doing, Coach? It's a pleasure. Hello. Oh, it's a pleasure. I nice see you. Hey, let me tell you, boys, it's a real pleasure to be here. Can't wait. Tell you what, man, it's really a pleasure to be here. I, uh, especially during homecoming week, my man. Tell you what, I, uh, never got to go to my own homecoming as a high schooler, man. Really, why is that, Mr. Gruden? Well, tell you what, here, man, I, uh, found this nice pretty lady named Tiffany at my school. I wanted to ask her the homecoming dance, so, uh, I was like, hey, Tiffany, go run a post route. So I, uh, throw it downfield to her. Turns out she ran a slant. Bam! They are square in the two front teeth. Old school called her a two-tooth Tiffany for the rest of the school year. <laughs> wow, John, that's pretty crazy. You're an animal. <laughs> I'll tell you what, man. I love animals. <laughs> you, uh, you, ever, uh, you ever watch the uh, National Geographic uh, channel? Yeah. You like that? Yeah, well, I'll tell you what, man. My favorite animal on there is going to be a rhino. A nice, tough... <laughs> yeah, I'm not even kidding, man. This is for real. <laughs> I tell you what, that's what the Trojans are going to be like Friday night. Charging like rhinos, man. Wow. Well, on that note, let's look at this week's game versus LT and Trojans. Mike, what are, you, what are the LT looking like? Well, the Lions are a pretty good team, but they got nothing on the Trojans. I tell you what, man. I, uh, you ever see a lion try to take down a rhino? That's some crazy stuff, man. That's pretty cool. Well guys, Trojan Nation is gonna be well represented as returning alumni and students are gonna be decked out in purple. LT's not gonna be able to see through that purple haze. They aren't gonna know what hit them. Trojans are gonna to look to establish a hard-nosed running game led by Connor Olson and Jared Whitaker. I'll tell you what here, man. Uh, so you're telling me the Trojans are gonna be running wild on Friday night? Well, I'll tell you what, man. This might be a little bit of a bold prediction here. But uh, I gotta tell you, I think uh, Principal K6 is gonna suit up, put on some pads and such, and uh, he's gonna go out there, rush for maybe 120, 150, no less than four touchdowns. I gotta tell you, man, someone get that guy a new birth certificate, man. That's right, some compare Mr. K6 to a cheetah when he's running with the football on the field. Nice, nice, man. Good stuff. Good. Well, I guess, I guess our safari's over, guys, but uh, John? You take your place at uh, your coach's chair, and it's time for camp. That's right. Time for John Gruden's QB camp with our very own Quinn McAnally and up-and-coming quarterback, Henry Hunter. John, it's a pleasure. I'll tell you what, son. That's Coach Gruden to you, Buster. I'm sorry, Coach. You check that attitude at the door, son. Coach, it's an honor to be here. I'll tell you what, man. It's an honor to be near uh, some hair like that. You uh, got any uh, insurance on a beautiful mane like that? Fortunately, I don't. It's a shame. I'll tell you what, boys. Let's, uh, let's go into your childhood a little bit here. Quinn, tell me your favorite QB to watch growing up as a young child. Uh, I have to say Tom Brady. Uh, I just love the way he plays and how he's clutch in late game situations. So you're telling me Tom Brady is your go-to quarterback despite his uh, alleged deflated ball situation? Uh, that was a uh, dark spot on his career. I'll tell you what, yes it was. Henry, how are you? Got to go with my boy Tim Tebow out of Florida because I love the way he plays with that energy and great playmaking ability outside of the pocket. I'll tell you what, disagree with that. Tim Tebow is a terrible quarterback. Boys, uh, before we go any further, I wanna dive into your minds a little bit, see uh, how you operate inside your head. So uh, check out some game film. Now, uh, I believe we have some film from a uh, Glenbard West game. 
All right, tell you what, you boys. We got some uh, game film here from the Glenbar West game. Now, uh, Quinn, why don't you come up here? Uh, tell me what your process was going through this play. Well, uh, what's going through your head here, bud? Oh uh, well, on this play, I'm reading number six. He's a uh, N on the outside there. I'm reading to see if he goes outside and stays with the flat route or gains depth and uh, comes to the in on number 17. And on this play, he uh, stayed, with the, stayed with the in, so I hit the flat, or tried to. Now, I'll tell you what, let me ask you a question. How come this kid doesn't have a name on his jersey? What's going on there? Uh, I'm not exactly positive, but... I'll tell you what, maybe that's, uh, maybe why we lost this one here. Could be. Andrew, uh, how about you? What you got? What's your, uh, what's your thinking? What's your thought process to uh, approaching this Coach. play? Obviously, I got one read on this, and that's call Omaha at the line, move some bodies around, chuck it deep to fig. That's all I got to say. I'll tell you what. It's a bold prediction, but I like it. I like it. I tell you what, boys, let's look at some, uh, let's diagram some plays here. I tell you what, my favorite play in all of football, it's going to be a spider two-wide banana. Now, a little test for you boys here. Uh, Mike, why don't you come up here and uh, just show me a spider two-wide banana. Got it. So right here, we got our classic Bronco spread left macchiato. We're going to take our our two tailbacks, boom, both sides of the tight ends set up a great wall of China, boom, figs going deep every time. I'll tell you what, you're a famous Jameis, give me the ball, give me that marker. You're, so you're telling me this is a spider two-eyed banana? Yeah, no, you, no, 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 you, you don't get to talk, son. This looks more like an orange millennium chocula, my friend. Get this out of here. Quinn, why don't you come up here and uh, why don't you show me a real spider to wide banana? All right, on the real spider to wide banana, we got the Z going deep, trying to take this corner out of the play. Then we got the guard, Liam Nineman, swinging out to the flat. And I drop back and hit him in a flat route. Right. I'll, tell you, I'll tell you what, man. Liam Nineman is an elite receiver in the West Suburban Silver Conference. I like this. This is a spider to wide banana. Good. And I'll tell you what here. Uh, Tony Romo, why don't you get up here? Quinn, give me this. Let me diagram a, let me diagram a little play for you guys here. You're going to tell me what it's called. So, starts off this guy. Woo! Goes over there. Nice. Quinn, or whatever quarterback here. Cammy, whatever. You're gonna drop back. It's gonna be a 15 step drop, but you're gonna kind of squiggle around as you do it. All right, I know you're not used to that. This wide out is no regard for any safety. Bam, nails the free safety, he's gone. That leaves this guy right over here. He's the key. All this stuff is happening over here, man. This guy goes out of bounds. This is the out of bounds. You got the bleachers over here, those fans in there. This guy goes out of bounds. You give him a little shovel pass. Bam, hit him. Refs don't see it. He comes in. Boom. Touchdown. I'll tell you what here, uh, Cam Newton Jr. What's uh what's this play called here? Uh coach. It's unlike anything I've ever seen before, but it looks isn't it the uh, decoy left uh, Z fly? So you're telling me this is a decoy left Z fly? Yes, sir. I'll tell you what, son. That's more wrong than catch up on the hot dog. You need to hit the books. Mr. McAnally, what about you? What's this called? Well, obviously, this is a uh, Honey Nut Cheerio right, Frosted Flakes left, with some chocolate milk running down the middle. You hear that, son? It's correct. Nice. I like it. Well, gentlemen. Well, thank you for coming to my uh, QB camp. I wish you both the best of luck, except for you there, Mikey boy. And uh, yeah, Mr. McAnally, you get the win tomorrow. Hope you, uh, hope you have uh, fun sitting on the bench. It was a pleasure.